Entrance in the group have to seal the exit. Attention! The turntable is switching on. Out of here, we won't accept this shit again. Okay? Animals. How can they? What can I do? The mutant? The watchman? A human? How did you? Oh. oh my god. It's you she's been screaming about. Alive! You came for her. All right. I'll help. Finally. I'll be of some use. Okay, they took the girl to the base chief for interrogation. I can't take you to the main entrance. Too many guards. But we may sneak in from the back. Let's go. Don't rush, though. If they notice you, we're both done for. Wait. You'd better not walk into the light. Let's do it this way. You sneak to the lighting panel and disable it while I distract them. That's what. What are you even doing standing here? Wait. Don't you have shit to do? You'll have to Everyone take him down. Can, Can you do it quietly? Come on, man. What's with that mumbling? Ah, your Mac. Time to fit that pine jacket, huh? Yeah. Wait a moment. Wait. 
walking this way, and we need to get to that door. Try distracting him. Look, there's some garbage around. Throw some. Great. Now throw it. I hope the noise distracts him. What? It stops Moscow from hearing anyone. And them from hearing us. Shit. This fucking sucks. Do you hear that, Archon? You were right all along. Do you see? It's not just Russia out there. It's the whole world. Oh my god. What for? Because the war is still going on. And you behave like fucking kids. Hello! All the guards will be here soon. Damn. I'm with him. I'm with you. You have to run. Is this yours? They just left it sitting there. We must get out before they recover. Get ready, people. Guards! You have to go sneak through the courtyard. Take the door the guards are coming through. Here, quick! Let's go. Who are you? I'm Brian Wallen Schirmeck, the train engineer. Run now! Just get to the hangar, then go to the... I'll get you out of here. So I'll get there easily. Why are you helping us, Andrei Ivanovich? I had... Uh, uh, I guess I'll tell you later. I hope... Uh, hey guys, be careful. Artyom, I see the enemy. Give me a boost. Can't really see well with the snowstorm. Don't forget your visibility gauge, Artyom. If you don't move too fast and don't come out into the light, you'll be harder for them to notice. Don't turn your flashlight on either, they could notice.
Attention! The command center came under enemy attack. The attackers are assumed to still be on the base territory. Change position, Artyom. All of 
great forces of the world upon immediately. Civilian personnel movement is prohibited until further notice. Attention! The general the is right there. We can break through. Great job, Artyom. We're inside. You can take the mask off, Artyom. to attack now these fuckers now i'll be stuck here for at least a week longer it's been over a month already and i feel like shit Group A, report to your status. Group B, continue patrolling the, the courtyard in the generator room. Gotta tell the Group weapons. A, check the wind turbine zone. Communications were lost there. Damn, how many guards do they have? Group D, 
Nobody here. No skin off my bones, I guess. Did we ever have a chance to relax like this before? I don't think so. Whew. Not getting shot at sure is nice for a change. Hey. All clear. Am I glad to see you here? Are you all right? I'm fine, thank you. All right. We don't have much time. They'll be back. I'll go to the engine. It should be ready now. You go up there and Come switch on, the Jim. turntable mechanism on. And please, be careful. We could easily have the whole base on us. Hey, stop! It's the enemy! More guards! Get them! Send your table! Running out of time. Come on, Artyom, turn the turntable on. Turn the turntable on. Come on, 
Gentlemen, Artyom and Anna have just made a huge mess, and I can't go back to Moscow now. The wartime legislation dictates they'd be killed. In any case, I have to get them out of town until it all blows over. But you all should stay. Hear me, Major? My people are in no way related to not my this call and you're misunderstanding. Well, I'll job. fight for the guys no matter what. Of course, Artyom, Anna, they are with the us. The no one behind. It's not it's not it's 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 All right, Spartans. 
Throw these overboard and full steam ahead. Come with me, Artyom. Let's catch them there. I'm so glad the boys supported us. It looks like my father didn't say a word to them about this either. We spent 20 years in Metro, thinking the rest of the world was burnt to a crisp in the war. But they just circled Moscow with those jammers, and we were none the wiser. How perfect of them!
not just traitors. We are honest-to-God enemy saboteurs! We stopped a hundred clicks from Moscow to check our Geiger counters. The thing is, they are all in the green. As if they're in a conspiracy. Still, this amazing piece of news doesn't really impress anyone that much. The guys are all confused as to what to do next. And I... I'm just waiting for answers. 
and hoping the commander, whom until recently I trusted implicitly, is going to be extremely persuasive in his reasoning. Why their own faces? We are at a crossroads, so to speak, where everybody can help but wonder, what next? Where do we go from here? Hmm, yes. More or less what I expected from you. But you got the picture. So, is your counter functioning? Have you checked it? Yes, it's all green. Double checked it. Stepan's in the green too. We don't need masks here. So, they were telling the truth. Who was telling the truth? Why won't you answer? Who are those people trying to kill us? Why would they shoot at you, the Order's commander? Explain something, at least! You owe us that! Well, I might as well drop the bomb now. The war did not end. What do you mean, uh, did not end? Let me finish. Most of our cities are destroyed. The rest of the country is probably under enemy occupation. To avoid new nuclear attacks against us, Command chose the only viable course of action. To play dead. To ensure radio silence, the shield system was created. A network of radio jammers covering Moscow and suburbs. So that some radio enthusiasts wouldn't bring more bombs down on our heads by whining on air. And it's one of these jammers that got disabled by the hands of those present here. Could you not have shared that before? Say, uh, before Artyom took that radio outside and caught all that radiation? No! I only got briefed half year ago. Under a strict, you talk, you die policy. And then had to tell my people we were securing a weather station. Sir, with all due respect, if we can't go back, Maybe we should advance and move on? I have an idea, but... Uh... Artyom, rather than carrying on with this silent disapproval of yours, check the airwaves. We should be out of the jamming range by now, so give it your best try. Look for transmissions from the Ark. <sighs> Do you understand now why we're traitors in the eyes of command? We shut down a jamming station. Shot up the guards, destroyed a patrol train, and ran away from Moscow. Who even needs a trial when the case is so clear? There's no way back now. Which means we have to continue moving forward. Command, what are you talking about? The Moscow Defense Command. Have you ever heard of the Invisible Watchers? I have, but they're just an urban legend. Not at all. They are command. Are you sure they care for more than just protecting their asses? You mentioned the Ark. What's that all about? If Artyom finds their signal, you'll figure everything out. Otherwise, there is nothing to talk about. Do you think finding that Ark of yours is going to fix everything? I do not. But if you have a better idea, then go ahead. Yes, I do. We have to find a good place for people from Moscow, like Artyom always wanted. Giving them all to the enemy? A grand idea. I say, we solve our problems before moving on to saving all Moscow, all right? How is it going, Artyom? Found it yet? There's a whole world out here, a world where we could live. So far, we only know one thing for sure. Radiation levels are nominal. The air is breathable. But what about the rain? So what? You can't even breathe in Moscow. So? Does anybody live out here? We don't know. How will they treat us? I don't know that either. What would they do if they found out there are survivors in Moscow? Again, I don't know. Keep looking out there. It's got to be a scene. But we do know we've been lied to. For 20 years, we've been lied to. We know they've been killing people. Collateral damage is inevitable in operations of such scale and secrecy. Yes, people have died. 
But the bombs killed tens of millions. Yet we are alive. Wait a moment, what was that? Why? Listen, everyone. Area 18-5. I repeat, proceed to the rally point. Rally point location is code 18 Where was that number supposed to be? Area 18-5. Only by standing together shall we overcome any and all of the mountain. So the route from here should go... Like this. This is our goal! So, is this what you had in mind? Yes! This is it! The Ark Project is a whole city underground. Enormous stores, machines, the best experts. It is the Commander General's HQ. All of the country's leaders are there. They have already started the restoration work! We will tell them that Moscow is alive! It wasn't all for nothing! Everything will change! Everything! Do you get it? A new life is starting for all the survivors of the world! Yeah. Oh, by the way, are there any single women in that place? <laughs> Great reaction. So, I think the moment calls for... <clears throat> Bring it out, Demir. Bring what out, Colonel? Sir? That thing that's been sloshing about in your canteen. <laughs> you think I'm deaf or what? Ah, uh, that. Uh, just a moment. I, I thought my ears were deceiving me. <laughs> <laughs> ah it's not a short trip to the Urals, so we should make ourselves comfortable, I guess. Well, let's name this bucket of bolts at the very least, eh? It's about time! Let's go around and be done with you. <laughs> nah, go to hell! <laughs> <laughs> Even better! Oh, come Pavot on! Aurora, the Roman goddess of dawn and a cruiser of, uh, uh, you know what. That's better. <laughs> Not bad. I like it. Ah, beautiful name! Sounds okay, but the cruiser of what? Yeah, I'll tell you later. Looks like it's decided. <laughs> Let's trick to the Aurora! <sighs> hey, Artyom, let's take a look at that map. All right, we had a round. That should be enough. Yermak, full steam ahead. Hi. Full steam ahead. Wow, that's some distance. I wonder how long it will take. How are you, Alyosha? Seems to me, whether it was intended or not, that our gunner now has a goal to strive for because of you. We all remember the way you fought back in D6, so no matter what lies ahead, we're with you. You can count on us. Yeah, yes, yes, for me. I'm not in the inventory check. Yeah, it is kind of cramped in here. I'm thinking of making something of a workbench. So that's all the instruments we get, and everything else would be within arm's reach. With no workbench, you just lose small components. We'll use this place to work on the weapons. Cleaning, oiling, 
Keep out of everybody's way, and keep them from messing with my stuff. And well, we'll have to take turns, of course, but we'll manage. So, if you find any weapons you'd like to keep, I'll store them for you here on the Aurora, and you can come back to exchange them. You'll get them back in their best shape ever, don't you doubt. Well, hello there, Tom. You people could have called me up there to drink to Aurora. I still think Beelzebub was a better name. <laughs> Two months ago, they loaded a bunch of people onto my Aurora. 